day. Free tris braid. Boat box curly small. One, because I didn't have any more one B. I got this from um Samsbeauty.com. I have six packs. I also got this oh, bun and bang two piece Chinese bun. China bun, should I say? For these combs, buy one, get one free. Brought some jewelry. And that's it. Basically, I'll be back. Deuces. Hi, you guys. It's Miss Nikki Red, and I come to you guys today to give you a tutorial of me installing some free tris folk locks curly crochets in my head and i'm just going to start off by putting the crochet needle through the braid latching on to the lock loop and pulling the opposite end of the lock through the loop of the other side of the lock i hope you guys can understand but yeah i'm gonna just do this method consistently through the video pull it through pull the other end of the lock through the loop and lock it in i hope you guys enjoy it stay tuned Uh, right now, I'm just going to show you guys the braid pattern, which consists of four braids down the middle and four to five braids going down the side. Okay, I'm going to do a voiceover at this point. Um, as you can see, I'm hooking the 6th braid to the 7th braid to stop that part to give an illusion that it's stopping and it's not going all the way back. I could have hooked two braids to each other when I did the braid pattern, but I chose not to because I always use this pattern right here to do my crochet braids. As you can see, after the first one, I hooked the sixth braid. After I hooked the sixth braid to the seventh braid, the next one after that, I just continue going down the braid the whole time. And I'm just gonna let you guys look and see what I'm doing. It's very simple, very easy. As you can see, you just Sticking your crochet needle through the braid, then get the loop of get the end loop of the lock and hook it on to the crochet needle and pull it through and hook the end into the crochet loop and pull it through and basically that's it. And as I'm putting the braid onto see I'm 
putting it in and pulling it over. And I'm only spacing it out just a little. Okay, I'm just going to let you guys watch as I do. Okay, right here, I'm showing you guys the same technique I did in the back. I'm doing it in the front. Only difference is that I'm not spacing the locks out as much as I did in the back because I would like for my front to be full. So, I'm just putting the lash through the braid, putting the end loop of the lock onto the latch, pull it through, get the end of the lock, pull it through the loop of the lock and pull it through it's the same technique and like i said i'm only using six packs so i'm not going to space them out as much as the back is you know by me being a licensed hairstylist i know exactly how many packs that my hair takes by me doing this style all the time because some people say you should use seven packs of crochet hair to get a full head but that's not true it's all about the placement of the braid and how the braid pattern comes out so by me doing this braid pattern i can be versatile which i can do a part on either side or wear a ponytail in the middle or pull all the hair crochet locks back from my face so yeah that's basically it i'm just showing you guys you know the same process i think this take about to an hour if that long to put all the locks in also, you can use um, five packs of locks and one pack of free tris beach curls. I did that style also. I think they call it the bohemian look. I tried that style. I don't like it as much as I like this style because the the bohemian, I mean the um, beach hair, excuse me, is like frizzy looking to me. So I prefer a clean look. So this is why I stick to um, just the locks without the hair. It's more cleaner. So after I finish doing this, I'm going to come back and give you the rest. Stay tuned. You Okay, I'm just showing you guys how it looks in the back so far. I like it. It's very full. I have like two and a half braids to go, if that much. I 
Okay, you guys, I'm back, and right now I'm showing you guys what I have cut so far because I wanted to have that bob look, so I'm cutting it and dancing while as I do it, just showing you guys. I wanted like that vertical bob look so far, it is beautiful. Thanks so much for watching. My camera was dying, I just come to show you guys the finishing look. I will add pictures at the end. Hope you enjoy.